Hey guys, we're going to uh, Port Orleans on Disney property. I heard the best beignets in Florida are in this place. Sorry guys, I wasn't planning to go to Disney today. That's why I didn't get my, oh thanks. Appreciate that. So we're gonna go in here and I actually don't know the name of the place where I get the beignets, so I'm kind of winging it. There is a restaurant right there. I might check that place out. Look at that, guys. That's kind of pretty. I've actually never been to this resort before. We got some alcohol masks, and more importantly, we got some beads. Those are some really big beads, though. Uh, I'm kind of short, so that would probably um, knock me into the ground. Just a heads up, guys. We went to the wrong place, but I wanted to show this place anyways because it looks so Mardi Gras. Look up there, guys. I, I can walk backwards. Make sure I don't hit anybody. I found it, guys. With my exploration skills, I've discovered a whole new world of beignets. By the way, this is the person vlogging this video. Here we got some specialty beignets, we got some originals, and they're all Mickey shaped because we're in Mickey World. Here you go. Thank you so much. Yeah. The time has come to try one of these magical beignets, guys. Shaped like Mickey Mouse. Oh, it's really hot and heavy and crispy. Now, as a true warrior of the beignets, you gotta mark yourself. I am now a warrior of New Orleans, guys. So let's take a bite without one of these sauces. One is strawberry, the other is chocolate ganache. I think I mispronounced that. <laughs> There's a powder on my lips. Without the sauce, it probably is the best beignet that I've had at a theme park. Thing, let's try it with the strawberry, guys. I'm something of a strawberry shortcake. It looks like this, guys. And I mean, I'm not gonna double dip because I have someone with me. She might um, get grossed out, so I'm gonna do it like this. It, it's snowing, guys, look. I'm gonna actually do that because it makes a mess. I will clean that after this. Here it goes, guys. Strawberry beignet in my face. See how, how tall and puffy it is? See that? That is quality, guys. All right, guys, so I am now kind of a beignet boy, a B squared, so I'm gonna go inside here and uh, get a to-go bag. I could have eaten the whole thing if I wanted to. In fact, I get two of these beignets in one bite. I don't wanna brag or anything, but that just comes with territory being a, a beignet boy, so. Oh, by the way, I wanted to say this. The strawberry dipping sauce was a lot better than the chocolate dipping sauce. Uh, but of course, you probably knew that already. I just wanted to clarify. If you ever want to get a beignet here, get the strawberry dipping sauce. This door doesn't open. We're gonna put this in a to-go bag. Yeah, we couldn't finish it, so they gave us a brown bag, kind of like uh, being back in school. Make it snow in there. We're gonna call that snow for now. And if you look inside, there is a magical beignet at the end of this rainbow, guys. End of the rainbow. If you guys are a huge fan of the Scat Cat Cafe where you got the beignets, you can get a shirt and wear it everywhere. You can get these mugs and drink it everywhere. Or you can get this cup and drink it everywhere. And besides me, who is the greatest beignet character ever, guys? Princess Tiana.